way too. Like, especially on PUBG. And we're live! With that, cold we're open. We're fucking live right now. Just and I have now. to adjust this fucking light. That's what I thought it was a good time to go ahead and knock it out and be live. Was it a good time? It was perfect that timing. For you? What do you What are you thinking that, of this? That's light? fine. That's better. That's a lot better. Yeah, that's good. Oh, oh, oh. All right. oh yeah, tone it down a little bit. Or I could crop it. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no. Okay, okay. Now you're, that's off. Okay, good. Just leave it like that. That's fine. All right. I mean, it's easy enough. I just need to do that on I, my phone. I, just, I should be able to. I just got it. Now it looks like I got to crop the top of you, though, because now you got like some shimmering effect. Hold on. You asked for it, man. You asked for that fucking I did. sheen. I wanted, wanted. I wanted the the. I wanted some trouble. I wanted some. I wanted a wrench thrown into the. Was it a stick thrown into Speaking my Speaking of wrenches, I need to be able to view chat in order to to understand the pure disdain for us that, that the viewers have. Hold on. There we go. That should get that shimmer out. And now you've become three times and as Mike large. And Mike Machai has become such a more popular streamer than he used to be. It's You're so now, good for him. How's it going, Nasty Maddie? Notice how Bomb is now like 50 people. three times the size when he leans forward. That's a superpower he has. When anytime he leans forward, he becomes three times the size that he was before he leaned forward. Oh, wait. Oh, not it's not my chat. Side. It's goddamn white bitch's chat. All right, there it is. Nasty Maddie, what the fuck is up? Good to see your ass in the stream it looks very much like deadly I premonition can see you and deadly premonition half download is what we're gonna be playing here that's the the plan so yeah, tears of the kingdom is good what a good game it is it's good to see that that game is good i'm just gonna start it without the download it's exactly what i wanted so i guess i could Give me that shit. I could but play something for four minutes. You could play Tears of the Kingdom for four minutes. You've only played two hours. You should be barely into it. You want me to put it in? Yes. Oh, you have the physical copy, but yes. It's your fault that it takes so well, long. It's no, such I, a I, I have it on my desk, so it doesn't matter. It's not that big a deal. So you want to see where I am? Yeah, I do. I love Tears of the Kingdom. It's a fun game. Oh, it was dear to my heart in Japan when a I was new sitting update. and didn't have anything to do. Yes, there is an update that stops the item glitching that you can do in it. Well, should I just start? I'll just you start. Can do whatever you want to do. Well, like, I, the I whole point was download. to not have to wait for the other download. So, if you're still gonna after two like, fucking months, DP is a good game. Got a ball of jack just for this moment. Just for this moment. You're trying to blame well, us. Fucking for your jack break Daniels that bitch open. Blame nothing. He's, He's blaming fucking us. giving us credit for this. He's giving me being blamed you, for his alcohol you, consumption. You and I are different when it comes to how we view his alcohol consumption. I am proud. You are ashamed. There's a difference. Anyway, crack that bitch open for me. And even more so, since it's seeming to annoy him, it's even better. It's even better. Like, relish every fucking drop. Check it out. Look where I am. It's like you're in a shrine. It's such a good game. You're gonna be crushing some gates with a hammer weapon. There it goes. Down it comes. No issues for Link. The barbarian, he's got fucking chest bear and everything. He's got a wood ash. Me, Link! You Zelda! Do I if I whiz on these trees, will they grow really tall? It's ain't postal too. You can't whiz, that I'm aware of anyway. You can use Splash Fruit, though, if you want to Ooh. try for 10. Is that how I get it on with Zelda, is I use Splash Fruit? It's the closest you're ever going to get, yes. You can throw Splash Fruit and it'll make a bunch of fucking splash around. That's probably what you want to go for. So we're going to play this for a little bit, and then we'll go to Deadly Premonition, where we're going to go from the, one of the greatest games of all time to one of the worst games of all time. That's, yeah, that's, that's really basically... what we're going to. <laughs> <laughs> That's the transition we're making here, and we're doing it quickly. We're not gonna hesitate to take this like tier one game down. He's got a construct uh, pipe. He's got a. I'm sure you'll do fine. He's got a whip weapon. He's is 
No problem. It's he fused it. He fused his weapon. When you can fuse with construct parts, then you start getting really powerful weapons. After you beat this guy, you need to immediately fuse the weapon with his horns. Oh, you got wrecked. I didn't know my health was that low. Three hearts is what you have, man. He killed me in one hit? Yeah, one hit. I didn't know. Welcome to this game, by the way. You're going to get hit in one hit when you have eight hearts. You don't understand. This game is different. I thought I would just go in, take the hit, and be fine. This game's like Final Fantasy 1. You step into the wrong area, you're going to get fucked up. Or you're going to be really good. One or the other. That's what makes me like this game a lot. If you're not taking damage, you can go really far into places you shouldn't be. Yeah, but this guy gets 10 out of 10 from me, just to let you know. I've, I've played probably 55 hours of this. I, I haven't gotten through the plot much at all. I still don't even have all the abilities. That's how far I've gotten. Not far and far. I know a lot about it. I know a lot about how this fucking game works. And you need to kill this guy, and then you need to take the weapon that doesn't have a fuse on it. That did very little damage. And the weapon's gone now. Whoops. Wrong way to throw. Yep. Throw with the um, R1 button. Oh, what the? R1. It's R1. You have to throw with R1. Who's gonna throw his own rock now? I tried R2, I think was my problem. Yeah, it's R1. <laughs> that did nothing. That's very little damage. You shouldn't have gotten rid of the weapon you had. You should have just beat him down with it as much as you could. That's not gonna do much either. Shoot his little targets on the top of his head, so at least you get the critical damage. There you go. He's got three targets there, it's easy enough to hit. After you hit him with that, he's stunned and you can hit him easily with a melee I need, weapon. I need to get my, uh, this is the best I got, or I guess this, I'll use this. Don't, don't, no, leave that, leave that, leave that. Go what? to the axe, go to the axe. Oh, uh, because I can... axe. You know, when you're done with him, you're going to have a really OP weapon. This is what you need to do, you need to take him out. Now, hit him, hit him with the axe. All right, immediately fuse. Don't start picking shit up. Immediately fuse with his horn. With what? The the weapon I have? No, that's a bow. Get that off. The what? No, the get the sword out. Get the sword out. This rusty one? No, the sword. This. Yes, the rusty sword. The five. We want the five. Equip. All right, now get fuse out and and fuse it with that fucking construct piece of horn. I'm right. Trying to remember how to fuse. How is it? It's it's hold the L. Uh, it's there L1, and then, yep, there it is. Fuse. Make sure you're pointing at that horn. You only this? have one chance. Don't do that. No. No. That, that, yes, that question mark thing. Yes, that. Do it. Y. Rusty. Hit Y. Hit Y. Hit the Y button. Hit the... Yeah. Now look how much damage this weapon does. You're in a different world now. You're in 15 damage land. Or 10, 10 damage land. Still better. You're in way better world. Double damage. Now we're then look Nasty at that thing. Nasty says bite can aim. I don't know why he's saying that. Since I look at that fucking thing, it looks sick. So now you know what's up. You've, you've taken a sword and stuck it to your shield as well. I think that's very interesting. Those fire fruit you can attach to your arrows to make fire arrows. They're great. You just got three fire arrows. Yeah, this level makes you use them. But now I need another uh, weapon with the stone on it. You do, unfortunately. So pick one of your sticks and find one of these stones on the ground and fuse them up and make that happen. To make sure you change your weapon to one of the sticks. That thing's your best weapon. That's for fighting, like, hard guys. Don't throw it. Don't throw it at people. Change your weapon. It's the right, it right directional button. It's the right D-pad. Right D-pad. Hold it down. Hold down right D-pad. Now pick what you want. Well, yeah, pick I guess what, I just no, want a stick. Want. That, just a stick. Yeah, you just want a stick. All you're going to do is break the damn thing down. So, fuse to that rock. It's right in front of you. 
go right up to it, and then hit Y. Yeah. And then you can break that down. What about, what's up here? Whatever you want is up there. Uh, more sticks. Be careful, those spikes are serious. They will hurt. Can I burn, should I burn with a, a fire arrow? Well, you can attach them to your sticks and make them strong. Those spikes are pretty strong. So if you take that stick, it's a two. Two is pretty lousy. I'd take the four stick. Get the four stick. There's a four stick there. Equip that. And then go ahead and fuse one of those bitches to it. You're going to like that. Okay. So that's a nine weapon now. Then take another one. Take one of your twos and get a seven weapon as well. Might as well. Because the other one's right there, and you won't be able to get it again. So that one, that two, the, the spear one, and then go for it. Oops. So you're getting fucking. Now you're armed. You are really dangerous at this point. I wasn't. In so many ways. I wasn't doing any of this. The game doesn't really instruct you very well. No, it doesn't. But that's how you win. You have to, like, make your weapons better by fusing them up. And there's really good opportunities early on, especially that 10 weapon you got, to really get an advantage. Hopefully there'll be one more construct, but I don't think there will. Nope, you're done. You win. Good job. You gotta, you gotta win here. But I know from Breath of the Wild, every once in a while there's something behind the exit that's happened before. At least it has. But this time, I haven't found one like that yet. I've beaten about 30 shrines. Good to see you with some good weapons now, though. That's really important. You're not even through getting all your spells yet, so... Nope. Like I said, I only played for like two, two hours. You should still be in the sky, from what I understand. Yeah. So good. Such a good... Game. I got a Dragon Ball. How many Dragon Balls are there in this game? I think there's like 155 or wow. something. But then there's another... There's another like 155 of a different kind. And then there's... It's... It's complicated. There's a lot more than you think there are. And Shinron shows up at some point? No. Hey, so like this ancient mythical guy that's helping me has a wife. That's good. She, he does. He does. And you can get to know her. You'll, you'll get to know her and her name. That guy's name is Raru, by the way. Raru? Yes. That's like something you'd say at a pep rally. I guess you could try. Rawru. I guess Ra Ra Sis Boom Ba is close enough. Could be Ra Ru. Uh, let me show you another game I was playing on playing. We, I mean, maybe we could play it. Check it out. What is it? Oh shit! It's Hyperspace Outlaw. On Hip the fucking Switch. Hypnospace Outlaw. Oh, I'm sorry. I misread. It's going to be pretty interesting. Yeah, we can play that. That sounds fun. Oh, I should kill this guy. I came because I need you, Link. I need to feel you inside of me. There's something I, I failed. About this guy. There's something I, I failed to, to, him. to give you. It's my love. He's got hot dogs. Please here. take my hot dog. Oh, what the? He's got a little bowl. His chest is like a shelf. It's nice. Uh, is that like a it's syringe? A wiener shot. Yeah, it's a wiener shot for everybody. A gift from Zunai Construct, designed to worn a, to be worn on a belt. It can power Zunai devices. What that I thing have is, just given is you fucking is dope, by the way. That device he just gave you is tools, fucking though. awesome. Devices. Can't demonstrate its utility because there are no Zunai devices right here. Okay, well that's... Sorry, I was going to give you a tutorial, but I can't. Zonai devices are awesome. That's all I can say. And now you can power them. I guess I gotta at least go do this tutorial. You gotta upgrade that thing as much as you can. Let me see. Let me see. Don't use the energy cell. That use use the uh 
The belt we gave you is awesome. Don't use any energy spells that you get. This you guy... won't turn them into devices. Although I have to say, I mean, I guess it's when you're up on the tree, the frame rate kind of drops, but what the fuck? I haven't had any frame drops, but my Switch is old, too. Like, I've really had no frame drops. We'll do... But maybe because you're doing Twitch or something else, I don't know. I couldn't tell you, but I haven't had any. I've been having a frame drop list of entire gameplay. I hate that. You can at least get your arrow back, though. They're pretty fair. They give you so many arrows in this. Arrows are not a problem. Oh, that's not what I want. Boxes and barrels and shit have so many arrows in them in this game. You just don't have to worry about arrows. Some people worry about arrows a whole lot. But... They can buy them, I guess. But... Where are you planning on floating with this? This looks like a boat. I don't see why any water. Oh, way. there is water there. Yeah, you're right. There is water. But why won't it rotate? It's not rotating the other way. Oh, you hold down the R1 button to rotate. Oh. Hold it. Hold it, and then you use the D-pad to do any rotation you want. I don't remember having to do that. Okay. That's because this is new. This is all new shit. I'm here though to help you. game is so good. They're fighting the blobs. Yes, you're gonna have to choose a side here. Oh, you fucked one up! Wait, smashing him with the rat. Good job. You should be able to one-shot these blobs with the weapons you have. Well, not with the bow you have, but I'm talking about the regular weapons. He's focused on that blob. Okay, get him in the back. You want this guy. You can make really good weapons with this shit, so you need to kill him. Make sure to get his horn. So you can enhance him. Alright, before you pick it up. Oh, you picked it up. You'd have had that I could, construct horn. You could have. Uh, I could drop it, on, it on the ground? You can drop it on the ground. That's true. It's just a pain in the ass to do that. So. Thick stick! Kind of, oh my god! That's great. You should put that construct horn on that. You need to drop something else you have, like that branch, because it's garbage. Drop the branch. It how dies drop, in three hits. It this. just breaks immediately. There's no reason Bite to even tight. have it. Get rid of that branch. Oh, drop that bitch. All right, now go to that thick stick. Get that thing, and then put the construct horn right on it. You have 12 of them. Holy shit. Yeah, you can definitely afford to fucking drop that thing. Then you hit Y after you use Fuse. Nice. Look at that. You've got a sick sword now. It looks awesome, too. This is how you get around the fact that all the weapons are fucking rotten in here. Well, Nasty Maddie, you can just watch Bite play and not have to worry about being frustrated. I love Zelda. Frustration makes me happy. That's why I play Mario Maker 2, though. That's much worse than Zelda. You probably don't like that game too much either. Oh, these are so... That guy has a double horn. If you kill this captain guy, you're gonna get even better weapon uh, thing you can make. Watch out, there's three of them. You gotta be careful, you don't have any hearts. That wind guy can F you. He F you. He did. He F you. I told you. Run, you're lucky you got respawned. You gotta get in a position where you can attack them. 
Get one of your big weapons. You'll kill them in two hits each. Get one of the big ones. I got one right here. Like, eight's pretty good. You should be able to use this. Or you could do the ten one. Two hits. Kill them. See? Get this guy with this shitty thing. You need to get him before he wins you. He's gonna win you. Go, go, go in now. Get him. Two hits. You're done. You knock the shield right off him. That's how, how powerful that shit is. Alright, pick up all their shit. There's a construct horn too, I believe, as well, among them. There's one more you didn't pick up. I guess I'll drop this stick. You've got a win thing now. You can use. Is that all of them? Yep, that's all of them. Actually, it was only regular construct horns. So that guy was telling. they're great. But that guy was telling me to talk to a construct about using something. Who who was he talking about? I have no idea. There's a thick stick. Drop one of your shitty sticks. I don't have a shitty stick. Um, you have a rock thing. Um, drop this. I'd drop that. Yeah, I would pick up that thick stick and I'd put a construct horn on it or something. You put a hot, you put a construct horn on that, and you're gonna be happy. Soldier, uh. Oh, it looks like one's already got a construct horn on there for you. But see, I don't need this. I... You don't. So leave it alone. Just leave it there. You can get it later. All right. So yeah, I don't. Uh... I don't have anything else to do, so I guess I'll move on to the shitty game. You could cook. You want to be able to cure, cure your health? Nope. There's a cooking spot over there. All right, nope. Then we move on. I don't have to save, right? I can just exit. No, you can just save. Oh, no, you should save. You I should, should save. save? How do I yes. save? Before you exit, go to the right there and save. And then hit save. Done. It's a great game. Great game. Recommended entirely. It can't be better than this one, though. Hopefully it didn't... You know, there's, like, PlayStation games... I think this happened at your house, right? Where when you remove the disc, it'll stop... Like, downloading. The upload, yeah, yeah, yeah. That happened in my house, for sure. That doesn't seem to do that on the Switch. They happen with Friday the 13th, if I'm not mistaken. No, we're doing Gran Turismo. I was going to try to get you to play that, remember? It's Gran Turismo 2. That was on the PlayStation 5. That's a whole different deal. Meaning, like, yeah, I started I with Friday the 13th, too. So the problem we're talking about, guys, is that, like, we want to play a game, but we want to start an update that we know is going to take a long time. So you put in the disc for Gran Turismo. Try to move to a different game. put in another game. disc. But then it will stop downloading for Gran Turismo. Yeah, it'll you quit downloading because the disc isn't in there. It's fucked up. So I need you to analyze the scene. You're in a forest. Yep. I see it. We're in, we're in a forest. Yep, we've got fucking children and some guy that looks a little bit like he's carrying a lot of weight. But he's really actually only got his hat and his own fat that he's carrying. Yep. He's, he's Look, walking like he's this carrying kid, This kid's found pounds. something. Yeah. They love bugs. Yep, it's a ladybug. He's got him. It is funny. There they go. It's dangerous to run around here, boys. I have to... Grandpa, hurry. Hurry up, you're too slow. You're too slow, Grandpa. You're old and busted, Grandpa. Well, I was noticing that he was carrying his own weight. People are so white. They are. Who's sweary? 
That's the guy's name? Apparently, or is it, is it alias? Japanese often use aliases on their names. If they don't want to have their names put on there, it happens a lot. Like, it happened in Mega Man 1, even. And Mega Man 3 as well. But it happens a lot. Some people are shy. They just don't want credit. Like, personally, they just want a nickname. There, there's a certain fear among some Japanese that their name will be used and that it's bringing misfortune upon them and it happens. See, you could use that image as your background for Facebook or something. This one right here. Yeah, I'm afraid I'd rather not. Or that one. But I need more fear. You're missing the, the woman on the tree. That's fine, I don't know. Those kids really are enjoying the sight. They've been staring for quite a long time. Hey, Grandpa. What do you think? Oh. Oh, that's slightly distressing to me. I don't know. Oh. Givo. And so that's just these two kids and grandpa staring at this naked, uh, tortured naked murderer. lady with a snake running all over. Don't you think the grandpa might be like, oh, look away, kids, but they're just both staring up at this woman. Like, how long have these twins been staring at this sight? Was I mean, it's, it's a pretty. I mean, I'd look at it. I'm not gonna lie. But with your with kids, with, like I bet they're still looking. Look, no. I would I would literally be trying to carve her off of that thing. That's what I would be trying to do if it was me. I'd try to figure out a way to get her off of there. See if it was safe, you know. There's cops now here. The kids are still there to look at it. They're still playing with that bug. I know they well, you know, they think it's kind of fun, right? They're not afraid. It's almost as it's almost as fun as the dead lady. You would think they'd escort the kids away from the dead body rotting in the sun, but no. No one's thought to do that. We don't know if she's dead. Oh yeah? Okay. I assume she's it's, alive. She's pleasuring herself, right? It seems like that's exactly what she's doing. Well, she's one of those crying orgasm people. No, no, that's not what that sounds like. Oh, okay. Oh, I guess it is it. Maybe it is. You're right. She's crying. Kinda. That's fucked up. My saxophone music. You like the saxophone music? That's a nice touch. Better than most music in games. So I'll give it that, that much credit. <laughs> she's very upset. Who is this mini cleavage fucking lady? Oh, is that what you're gonna call her? Micro cleavage? Mini. Mini cleavage, yes. It was mini cleavage. That's what that was that we were looking at. <laughs> Am I supposed to understand why everyone's crying? Nope. The opening is just people crying. Kids who have no emotional reaction to seeing a dead woman in a tree, and then random people crying. Query directed it, too. I love Query, or Sweary. Sweary, it's Sweary, it's not Query. Are you ready for the greatest adventure? A deadly profession of playing my acoustical guitar. Our game music is good. I mean, Bite Binge might be fucking having a conniption over there, but the, uh, so far, looks like there's good music in this game. Surprisingly good music. 
so far it's been well coordinated too, even though it's live action. So we'll see what's going on with this music. These are wave files they're using. We'll see how good they do when the game actually starts going. I know. I only gave a shit. Someone gave a shit about the music at least in this game. So I'll bet it's all right. Where's, where's uh, invert? Oh, aim? What? It's aim. It's aim setting, man. You want to invert your up and down, man. That's what you're trying to do, right? Yeah, I'm trying to invert vertical axis. Do it. There we go. I guess I want to do the same thing for camera. I'm one of those people. Everybody's different. I mean, ever since, like, uh, I think the first double joystick game I ever played was Time Splitters on PlayStation 2. Because, like, PlayStation 1 didn't have shooters that used both joysticks that I could remember. It was only when PlayStation 2 first came out and Time Splitters. It was N64 that did it first. But it didn't, but it used buttons for the only. Yeah, I know, I know, but yeah, you're right. As a twin stick, there were there were some games though that were twin stick games on uh, PlayStation PS One. But they were yeah. I don't remember. I never played a first person shooter that used the twin stick. I think there was Rainbow Six and a couple others that did. But um, yeah, I get what you're saying. There was nothing mainstream that did. So when PlayStation Two came out, Time Splitters was a launch title. So I had SSX and Time Splitters, two great games, by the way, two good launch games. Back then. I bought the bouncer, which was the wrong game. <laughs> <laughs> yep. What a loser. I agree. That was a big mistake, but that's what I did. I bought the bouncer and the PlayStation 4, and then I got Final Fantasy X a couple months later, which was nice. X came out like a, over a year post-release uh, of the launch. Really? Yeah. It was that long, I don't remember, but it was worth it on that game. I wish I knew what those kids were whispering to each other. It is pretty nasty. Fight is now in control of this matter. Could you wait just a little longer? What are they doing? Why are they bobbing like that? This won't take long. What are they doing? What are they involved in right now? They're doing something. See, this they're is... Speak, they're speaking Korean. This is what... Are they really? No. I don't think so. It sounds like Korean, though, but it's not. We're getting the fire. A doll shaped like a fat man. It has a plate on it which reads Washington State. Good thing I observed that. A dummy. Nice. Interesting. So I'm in a dream state where these kids are doing something. Does he live in this room? Not a ghost from the looks of him, but mysterious nonetheless. Is it my DVD collection? Francis York Morgan. Oh, it's me! I get a trading card of myself. Nice. Good to get those points. Could you wait just a little longer? Oh, you get to watch all this. I like how I like how they bob in that weird way. That will teach you to, to talk to them again. I noticed their smile, they have like that weird smile that looks awful, like almost like in Seaman the game, like it's just poorly animated smiling on 3D models. It's locked. Oh, it goes into this dark void, see? It's where you want to be. Too bad they won't let you get in there. Maybe I should another talk one. to them again. There's another one. There's another. Don't talk to them again, you dumbass. 
That one's locked too. Maybe now I could talk to them and they'll do so. Oh, there's a TV. I think that's a TV. You can watch a the white TV. screen. Maybe now they'll talk to How's them. the frame rate in your actual game? Seems okay to me. Okay. Is it low for you in Discord? It is. Don't worry about Discord. It's not important. Could you wait? Just God damn it, though. Stop doing that. Well, they're bobbing in this weird fashion. And, like they're doing something. This won't take long. I mean, what are they doing? They're talking about this won't take long. And they're just... They're like, oh, this... It's taking so long. Uh, you don't know what the fuck you're doing. So what? What do you want from me? <laughs> Sit in the bench. And quit being Red leaves bitch. fluttering the air. Maybe this time I need to stop it. Finally. Sorry to keep you waiting. It will start soon. Yeah. It's about time to get started. Did you ever watch Twin Peaks? It's yes, absolutely. There's a lot of similarities to Twin Peaks you'll see in this. If you can hear the music voice, is similar. Could you respond? That's saying something because uh, David Lynch wrote the music for Twin Peaks. Yep. Don't be surprised. The crime took place out in the country this time. Let's take it slow. Okay, Zach. Have you played this before? Some of it, yeah. Okay. That's why you're aware of the Twin Peaks similarity. Because the Cooper thing, I don't see where that comes yet, but it sounds kind of like it's coming. I think that's one way of looking at it. But it's totally wrong. There it is. Francis York Morgan is, is Cooper. Yep. Listen, they both need each other. It's called interdependency, and they both know it. Like, who's he talking about? Yeah, I know. Those twins. Terrible things to Tom. Nasty, even sadistic things. But that's fine. As Is he driving and, and using his laptop at the same time? He's always he is, right? It's partners. Sure, yeah, he's the, using the his phone. Back he's smoking, using his phone, and using his laptop and driving at the same time. Yep, that's all very, very 1995. Uh, so. He's talking about Tom and Jerry also with the guy on the phone. Hello? In the rain, by the way, <laughs> on a mountain road. I can't believe the Bureau still can't get me a satellite phone. These puppies are making me go to another town in the boondocks again. Well, I'll be a happy cat. Even if it ends up being a waste of time, at the very least it'll get me in Cram City for a while. Right, Zach? Perpetrator from the last case really was something. Could have thought there'd be razors laced into your nails. Crazy. Just crazy. He just Days smoked a cigarette. You know, at least I now have a scar to show off. So he got a scar from his previous case, I guess. Oh, yes, uh, a razor. I got this when I arrested the Catwoman wannabe. Women. They're crazy. Don't you agree, Zach? Man, Zippo's suck. That's why it's not yeah. working. I know. <laughs> oh no! Oh, I'm so surprised he got into an accident driving while smoking, <laughs> talking on the phone, in the rain. Using a laptop. Using a laptop, yes. <laughs> Your laptop and phone. 
Stupid motherfucker. Wait, this is us. We're the good guy. We just talk on the phone, smoke cigarettes. They've established us all, already, though, as a stupid motherfucker. <laughs> so it's good to see. And now it works. <laughs> see? There's fire all around me. He was like, I'm going to try the lighter again. <laughs> well, he needs that cigarette. I mean, come on. <laughs> I'd have been at that fire. I'd have been, like, fucking crawl into that fire. I'd be like, come on. Give me my light. Is it both dead because they suck? Zach, there goes the civilized world. Is that like a Joker face in the lower right? Need that steel pipe. Lead pipes are better, but sure, steel, steel will do. There's a run button there. Yeah, there it is. What about my stuff? Did I get my laptop and things? Just up that must be. They were destroyed since. by your stupidity. <laughs> what am I gonna say to the police? Am I gonna tell them about how I was on a phone smoking a cigarette, trying to use my no, laptop, no, driving no, in the rain? Did. You saw a red figure in the road and you swerved to avoid it and crash. That's all you say. Gun? I already have stuff in this thing? It's weird. I don't even know. There's nothing there. It looks like this is bugged. There's nothing in there. Why would I want to put stuff in there now? At the very beginning of the game. I have no idea. It doesn't make any sense. It looks bugged to me, but it's probably not. You're about to be in a conflict right away, it seems. That's my conflict. Oh, conflict of the gate. Yeah. The skin is very plasticky looking. It is. It's glistening. Why is his eyelids are weird, and his eyelashes seem to be coming out of the middle of his eyelashes. Yeah, his of his eyes eyelids. Are, the underside of his eyes are more wrinkled than mine. I'm profiling now. He has to close his eyes to profile. Are you profiling along with him? I am. I've always profiling, especially you. Really. I'll let you I've profiled you racially, sexually. What? Why did it have to be sexually? Why did you have to bring that into it? Because everything you can profile someone by, you should do it. You've been profiled in every yeah, but way. You've when been you were profiled by your age. Yeah, but when you were doing it, did you close your eyes? By the number of hair follicles that are still alive. But everything. Can you at least profiled. confirm that when you're profiling me, did you close your eyes while doing it? No. Really? I, I did it over years. So you didn't like close your eyes and do it all at once, like no, this guy does. Of course not. No, I did it over a long period of time. I know everything. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! What, what the? Oh my god! All of a sudden, there's a clip of a guy saying, "Don't shoot." Oh, he's trying to tell you something. Look what you did! You shot that dog. You're horrible. Huh? You don't remember this. You were blacked out drunk, but you shot that dog. He tried to warn you. There's more. Why is everything beat shaking? Them, beat them with a the pipe. Taryn McCulkiner is here. We haven't seen this guy for a while. Welcome, motherfucker. Oh, god damn. I have not seen you in a while. You want to play some PUBG tonight? Yeah, you could play some PUBG. You could. Although, we're playing this really shitty game first, Deadly Premonition. Depends on the time. I'm gonna go beat up the zombie woman. The zombie woman deserves to be beat up, right? Definitely, especially if it's with a lead pipe. The steel pipe will have to do in this case. Excuse me, lady. I need to beat the, f the fuck up. 
Where'd she go? She became a save point. Can of pickles. Never mind. That she became. She, she that became. Was not a save point. She became the can of pickles. Uh, hit that button. I modded my Xbox and got all the games. I'm 26, so I have a lot of catching up to do for the first gen Xbox. Play Mech Assault. Make sure you play Mech Assault. Play Viva Pinata and Viva Pinata 2 as well. I think that's 360. It's a fantastic Xbox game. Also, Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts is quite good. A lot of people give it some shit. They can give it all the shit they want. It's a good game. Is she? What is she doing on that shelf? There's nothing. On Why is she doing Limbo? Oh, that love on Xbox. What? Why is she doing? The Elder, the Elder Scroll games are better on the PC. So Why is she limboing to me? She's a limbo champion. I'm talking about Morrowind, bitch. I said Elder Scrolls. I didn't say Skyrim, and I didn't say Morrowind. Oblivion's the one that's on the 360. You're fucked up. Anyway, I'm talking about the OG Xbox. Bitch. I guess that the nuts and bolts and those are on the 360. I already You're told right him it's 360. That. He doesn't remember what games are on 360 and which ones are. Oh my god. I do remember. No, you don't. The, the, the Xbox 360 doesn't have a lot of good Viva games. Viva Pinata's not on Xbox. Or no, no, the Xbox, Xbox. I mean. Ooh, bandage. This is nothing like Twin Peaks. This is a zombie game. They're not zombies. Look, at, look, they're limboing, though. They're, they're zombies. This is a zombie they're game, just not Twin Peaks. They're limboing. Nothing to do with Twin Peaks. You've lost the Twin Peaks on me, and now this is a zombie game. This is going really well until that happened. I can't go through the... Oh, that's like the, uh, the upside down. I can't go into there. You can't drop comparisons to fucking uh, Stranger Things. This is a shitty zombie game. Just because they have black eyes and they limbo their zombies? Look, I'm profiling. Hold on, I'm, I'm profiling. I'm, I'm profiling. I'm profiling. I'm profiling. Okay, I'm done. Been through a lot of crazy situations, but that one. Did you see any profile? That one takes the cake. It's the first time I've been attacked so directly. Did you notice me profile that. hardcore? Can you give me a logical explanation about what that was? Did you, did you see Come me profiling? Answer. Life is fun because of the mysteries. Right, Hello? Sir? Are you there? Are you talking to me? Yeah. I'm here. Yeah? Did what you, did you see me profiling? You mean that guy? Yes, I saw No, him not him! Me! I can't profile shit. I was profiling. Hardcore. No one could profile as hardcore as I was just doing just then. I'm like the main character in Scanners, but instead of blowing up people's heads, I profile them. You ever see Scanners? No. Really? Man, you need to see that. It's a classic. I saw a Scanner Darkly, but that's different. No, it's completely different. Uh, pop culture ain't gonna be me that ends up being the person who saw and shit. Nice. Looks like my PUBG's updated and ready to go. It's good to see. I got hurt. Can I? Oh, I guess I can't. Let's go run through this. Can I bust open these things? How do I change my weapon? I don't remember. I can push this to death. I'm gonna push this box to death. Check it out. 
See, Use I'm... Your stupid no, no, look, I'm control. pushing the box to death. And look at me doing it. See this box? I'm destroying it with my push action. Oh, yeah, you see that? <laughs> oh, I bet you didn't know I had it in there. You already see it again? Here we go. Oh my God, here, here we go. go. I'm pushing this fucking box to death. This box has never been pushed like this before! I bet if this box was you, you would be dead. You know why? Because look, I'm pushing this box to death. Pushing it until it's destroyed! The zombie game, guys. <laughs> this is what we've been roped into here. As you have to understand, he roped me into a zombie game. He knows I don't like You zombies. knew I was gonna push that box to death. You knew it was gonna happen. More fucking zombies. God damn it. Seriously. She's trying to. I love how as you kill zombies, the cash register fucking comes. Yeah, you're rich now, motherfucker. You just killed the zombie. You're rich. Ching, you're running a business now. Nothing. You know, I feel like you're never going to get anything out of the box that you don't push to death. If you really want to push a box to death, that's that's you just got to do it the way, you know, the old fashioned way. I'm going to knife the next guy. There. They don't seem very formidable. They're zombies, man. They're fucking zombies. Meaning. The whole game is meaning. I gotta get to the next section. Stuff is gonna happen. With zombies. <laughs> We, uh, that zombie was carrying a first aid kit. Yeah. As zombies do. Well, what if you got injured? So far, nothing has been in a box, ever. Well. You know, Keep you guessing. Out. Put item away. Nothing. Nothing. I don't need the lollipop, right? I put my lollipop away, and I put my pickles away, and my... What about my cigarettes? I don't need that, do I? I probably need my coffee, though. There's zombies everywhere, man. Do I need coffee for that? Oh, fucking no. Zombies. It looks really bad. I love how the evidence spins like that. I'm gonna profile. I'm profiling! I'm pro filing! Man, you were playing Tears of the Kingdom before. Well, you don't like this one? This one's just as good. This is a zombie game. You're really focused on calling it a zombie game over and over. Now I can go. All zombie games are the same. That's the problem with that. Ching. Love how it's really the barrels that have the items in them, and you're just like not breaking them open. Only breaking open the box. They have what? No items. Items. 
have items in them. This is a zombie game, man. I know what I'm doing. I just don't like them. Well, you mentioned the a few have times. Items in them. Well, wait, do I need to break a barrel open? Go, I'll, t I'll show you. Go break a barrel no, open. No, I don't need Go to. On. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. How are you leaving? You're not leaving. You're just sitting there like a dipshit. Look, I'm in. You are in. Power in the area should be much more stable now. Let's hurry ahead, Zach. It sounds like a film projector. It sounds like a generator. It sounds like a gas generator. It actually sounds exactly like a gas generator. Like one of the ones that smuggled nicely instead of sounding like I'm a lawnmower. Now try this barrel. I'll bet the barrel has an item. Why? This guy's about to limbo. I can't break the barrel. You can break the barrel. Get this guy first. He had shit in his pants. How do I switch weapons? Okay, there we go. See, I can't break it. I'm just damaging my item. It's a zombie game. Why do you keep saying that over and over? They have to limbo. Their only method of attack is limbo. For some reason. Dead. You're dead because I'm a zombie. You now, lame. It's a fucking zombie game. I, I mean, dead. I wish someone you would tell me what type of game this is, because I'm still confused about what type it is. Oh, I thought it was Twin Peaks, but then I realized it was a zombie game. What What would you call a Twin Peaks game exactly? Oh God, it would be better than this. It would have to be a murder mystery, obviously. Well, who murdered that woman in the tree? Zombies. Viruses. I mean, it's a zombie game. We're not doing anything like Twin Peaks. There's no mystery at all. Who murdered that woman in the, the tree, right? Who gives a shit? Everybody's murdered. It's zombies everywhere. Nice shot. Oh, Three headshots to kill that guy. Nice shot. Just stay away from obvious danger. That's where the zombies are coming from because it's a zombie game. I don't know, I'm not. Oh, I'm... you just took damage. That zombie, even though he's totally horribly uh, inept, he's still managed to damage you. I think they're just gonna keep coming, right? Can I? There's zombies, man. 
Why are you shooting the gun at the fucking box? Because. You shoot them at the fucking barrels if you're gonna do anything. Isn't that where I came from? Which way did I come from? I this don't way? know the answer for that. It's a zombie game. You got more zombies all over the place you need to fucking deal with. Huh. Well, where's this third key? I'm All right, Terran likes the fucking zombie game. Yes. But I mean, I'm a minority yes. in this Amazing. fucking series. Yes. This fucking McDonald's likes it, and you like it. And I'm sitting here. He's only fucking thinking it's good. It is pretty I think dope. It's a poor shit game. That's the only reason. I'm just like, yes, let him suffer some more. I think uh, you're not seeing the match. Game is a trope. I think it's pretty clear you can't go through the jail. You can't climb over that fence. This is not fucking Tears of yes. the Kingdom. Great. How do you get all this money? It's all money that you're just getting. You're getting rich fucking killing these things. Amazing. Getting nothing but money. You have unlimited ammo? Yeah, during the sequence. Right. So you're just farming now, that's what you're doing? I don't I don't even know how to get past this. You didn't hit left. I tried. You failed so hard. Hold on. There's something I need to do. Failure! What? There it is. Where did that come from? It came from me. I gotta I gotta get to that guy again. Whoops, I don't wanna go to this. <laughs> You just failed to push a button. It's so unexciting, though. It's not like you're doing some great move or like getting through a sick Mario Maker level or doing something skilled. You are literally failing to push the fucking L joystick to the right. That's what you failed to do. Well, yeah, I know. And I saw it. I was there. This is the shittiest zombie game yes. I've ever seen. Well, the hack of everyone thinks it's dope. I'm, I'm, I'm a minority. I still have to stick with what I fucking realize. I'm like the Emperor's new clothes. That's oh, what I am. I call it as I see it. It's just a zombie game, another one. Nothing special about it either. It's really mediocre, honestly. There's a lot of money you get, though. I'm going back this way. Oh, yeah, it's that. So at some point that they never stop coming. Yes. You have unlimited ammo. You can just keep running around shooting zombies and getting. Well, I think eventually I can go this through is like this. Like what right? I would do for my job. If you get ten dollars each, just shooting zombies that are totally not able to do shit unless you're retarded, then what you need to do is just get ten dollars a pop on those motherfuckers. I'd be rich. I'd be rolling in money. By a month from now, I'd be fucking done. I'd be retiring. <laughs> Some other motherfucker to shoot these zombies for me. Look at that! Something exploded. Bullseye. I think I need more beer. Great. Man, stupid PUBG clan. Damn. He said no. He shook his finger. I don't get to live or progress. 
How drunk is the bum? I don't know. I, I think he's still getting there. I'm on my sort of... Sort of second. I need to drink water now that I think about it. Huh? I'm just sitting here watching a zombie game at this point. So, what's going on? My brain is starting to fry slowly from just naturally having to observe this. And then there's also the alcohol that I've Wait, been no, but what? Rate of profile! Get ready to profile! Get ready to profile! Profile! Do it! Profile! It's bad, Taryn. It's bad. Be profile! I'm pretty wasted. Much more than usual. I can't even speak correctly. You didn't even profile during that segment, did you? Sure you can fucking realize it, actually. I got started early. Oh, yeah. there's definitely something in this town. Do you feel it, Zach? The coffee warned me about it. Yesterday morning, the milk I poured in my coffee made a sign. See? It said, tomorrow you'll arrive in a place to change your fate. Right. Exactly. Oh, I'm saving through the telephone? How do I get back? Do I just run? I'm running. You know, what if they made a deadly premonition Grand Theft Auto? You know, or like a a, a side story that's like uh, Grand Theft Auto? But they made zombies for Grand Theft Auto. You can play a much better game than this just by downloading Wait, that mod. You're saying... It in your this is yes. not as good as Grand Theft Auto? Not even close. No. Can I kick this rat? No. I'm surprised they even bothered animating that rat. <laughs> what? Look at look at this! Look! Look at this! Wow! I found a glitch! You, you found yet another glitch in this game. <laughs> this game is a fucking <laughs> Glitch just existing. Tell oh, me. that was. I like that though. It was fun. Of course you did. Yeah, because you found something novel in this. You made it worth playing. Because it's a shitty zombie game. And you're just showing how shitty it is. And that's actually really cool. But it's still a shitty zombie game. Now look, I got someone to talk to now. Now you were very late. So listen to that Twin Peaks music. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. FBI special agent. Not giving Francis you any York Morgan. Please Twin just Peaks call me York. On this. This is That's what everyone game. calls me. Agent York? Good, that's good. Are you the sheriff? Uh, no, I'm Deputy Sheriff Emily Wyatt. George, he's the sheriff. He went looking for you, actually. He should be back soon. I see. I see. I see. If you don't mind me asking, did you walk all the way here? <laughs> yes, I did. My car broke down, that's all. I was smoking and talking on the phone and using my laptop and, uh... <laughs> Here's his chance to bring it up. She's like, I love you. You're not a zombie. <laughs> She's easy on the it's... eyes. <laughs> Definitely worth a trip to the primitive world. By the way, don't mention anything about what happened back there. She'll think you're a psycho. Don't want that, do we, Zach? Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm the sheriff, George. Smack! Wooden. He just smacks Come you. <laughs> smack! I'm Smack, Sheriff Woodman. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. It's not a real FBI badge. Please, just call me York. That's it's what definitely calls. fake. Could you tell me why the FBI is so interested in a small town homicide? Let's just say it's a personal interest in killers of young women. I'm always looking for new sample cases to help me with my profiling. Both our superiors have cleared this with each other. You can remain in command. You don't have no it problem. Seems that where are the zombies no. that were everywhere? No problem. Why are they able to have this dramatic conversation as if there's not straight. zombies everywhere? Our small town has What the fuck is problems. wrong with this game? Yep. 
I don't see you're acting like this one murder matters, and it's really <laughs> actually <laughs> fucking zombies <laughs> everywhere. What is fucking wrong with this? I need you to understand that. I hate it. Of course. Of course. By the way, George, I... Well, she does not like smoking, does she? Could you send someone to take care of it? Oh, and my clothes and luggage are still inside. All right. Don't worry. I'll get my assistant, Thomas, to take care of it. I'm Thomas! Do you need anything else? Thanks. That'll be all. Well, then. I think I'll rest up first at the hotel. Do you have any cigarettes I could have? Then I'll join you on your investigation. I'd like don't know how to say it. Please, that'll Duh. get me through the next <laughs> day. <laughs> Unlike yeah. some of your corrupt city police officers, I play it by the book. I hope you'll come to appreciate that, Agent Morgan. J.J. Abrams directed the scene. And we'll handle the All investigation. Lens flare. You just think of this as a vacation. Take it easy. Enjoy the nature. Meow. You don't have to be a tree worshiper to appreciate the wildlife here. I am a tree worshiper. Just so happens I kneel down and fucking Let's suck tree the roots every morning. There are no cavemen Thank you here. very much. We're as far forward as the Middle Ages. And we've just met the king. Love Mauve? What did that say on the license plate? Zombies. Zombies? This is how games were once designed. Games were designed this way at one point. This is how games used to be presented to the audience. I like how I was like, why not? Why not? There's Joker's face there. What do you think of that? You know, it's a zombie. Previously during the investigation. These puppies get a drink. are making me go to another town in the food docks again. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. Welcome. I'm the sheriff, George Woodman. Call me George. There's definitely something in this town. You feel it? Yeah, something? zombies. There's zombies in this town. You guys are fucking on crack, every one of you. They're all crackheads. I figured it out. This guy's a crackhead, too. They're all fucking crackheads. It's zombies. They even refuse to recognize it, though they're killing them left and right. It's not like I've come to your town because I've killed 38 fucking zombies. No, that's not what he said. He's just like, yep, I need to stay at the hotel. Thanks very much. Smoking my cigarette. There's zombies everywhere, but I gotta say nothing about that. Cause it's not, it does, it's just part of the job. I just shoot zombies all the time and then solve murders that are not related to zombies. Fuck you. Bitch. He knows how to get me fucking riled up. Fight Binge does. Just give me a fucking zombie game. A shitty zombie game. The worst. I could be killing motherfuckers right now, but I'm watching this shit. And these zombies don't even fucking do anything to kill him either. They just sit there, and he still ended up getting killed because he's a dipshit. But... Anyway, it's good to be home, I'll say that much. As much as this zombie game sucks ball, it's good to be home.
Uh, nothing is fucking happening on this motherfucker. It's not fucking common sight. I think I could just chill and not even fucking worry about that shit because nobody's fucking paying attention. how I like it. It's bite binge stream. Fucking laid back. Except for the fucking zombies. Fuck that shit. Welcome back, bite binge. Thank you. I hope I hope you come back refreshed. I am refreshed. Hey, yeah. drink. Guess what I have here? Zombies? No. In this no. glass. Rum and Coke? Nope. Jack and Coke? It's more syrupy than that. Amaretto and Coke? No. What? What is Using it? Red Bull. One of the ingredients. Oh, is it a Jaeger bomb? It is Jaeger and Red Bull in this oh, God damn, amazing I have Red Bull. glass. I can do this. I can do a gin and Red Bull, which is gross, but I can do it. Well, I have Jaeger. I don't have Jaeger. I lost all my Jaeger. I used it. I used the last of it. This is my last Red Bull. I have two Red Bulls. I have no Jaeger. I have two 16-ounce Red Bulls. They're big ones. So, what we learned about our character last chapter is that he's irresponsible. Zombie. He and then he sees zombies and he doesn't tell anyone about it. Oh, God. He murders zombies and doesn't tell people about it. He's gotten 32 of them. He's killed 32 zombies and has not mentioned it. As if it's nothing. He's just going to that hotel. He's like, yep, yeah, I killed 32 zombies like usual. Like every day in the forest. It the happens on forest. every case he works it's just, it's just on. Every case, every he, case works he works on. So it's just like, he's just like, yep, this is fucking zombies again. But that doesn't matter. Nobody else. But it's does. obviously a delusion. It's all, it's all he's just murdering mind. random people throughout every case he works on. <laughs> oh, the door opened. Nice. Oh, well done. I'm glad you checked that. That fucking saxophone player can't stop fucking blowing his shit into that horn either. He's like, ah. well, the soundtrack for this game is actually kind of cool. It I, is, I make fun it's of it. It's a little old. It's getting old because you're taking so long to get a fucking drink. I've heard that fucking saxophone blow his motherfucking load into his fucking armature the last fucking hour. So, I'm in my pajamas. Yeah, I see that. He's trying to use telekinesis on me. Hold your breath. They can't see you if you hold your breath. Hurry. Like this. Cover your mouth. L R. Z R. Say look, I got a little, little kid. Bit. A little kid teaching me how to hold my breath. To sneak past zombies. I would just murder that guy because he's the worthless. Look at him. He's just trying he just, to he doesn't even have, suck off an imaginary lady. He doesn't there. even have teeth. He's not even there. How's he going to bite me and hurt me? He has no teeth. Teeth don't help when you're sucking someone off. So he's good. What is happening? He's sucking off an imaginary <laughs> lady. I thought I told you that before. What the fuck? Are you not listening to me? I, mean, I thought this. This is a weird scene, okay? And when I fucking... <laughs> I told you, though, what was going on. You can't expect it any less. You do the same. Why it's do they stand there for so long? They, they is he just shitting his pants and they're, like, covering their nose? That's part of his ritual, yes. Who are you? 
Mr. Poopy Pants. I'm not a zombie. Thank you. Have a nice day. It's the only not zombie. Other than the sheriff and that lady. Can of pickles. Yeah. I'm, I'm have... glad it's instructed me about the, the fact that can of pickles exist. This guy has a hotel and he didn't shut his own lights off. Or it's the window that's doing it. It's the daylight. He doesn't like the daylight. Better smoke a cigarette, dude. You gotta do it. Fuck, come on. Get up. The first thing you need to do when you wake up is smoke your fucking cigarette. You know this. Zach. I know we're streaming. My dreams continues to intensify. Yeah, but why is the oh, bot in trees? Oh, the bot didn't notify Carpet. people. No, it that's didn't. why so many people are in this. Stream yeah, the bot didn't notify anyone. And oh, that's because it's me. That's why. But that child that's is what still me the most. You should get the bot to notify for you Sweet. too. No, remember that costs money. I just can't Jesus, remember where. Jesus, what a piece of shit. We looked into that at one point, remember? It was a long time ago. You might want to look into it again. But yeah, we don't want to pay. For now, we need coffee. Let's head to the cafeteria, Zach. I hope they have some real coffee. I really need some coffee. Then we can head to the sheriff's office. There's a proper procedure for everything, right, Zach? Oh, da, da, da. I need to get my clothes. I'm a suit. I need this one. Here we go. Oh, the red one? The red one. Look at this. Look you didn't at me. like workaholic. Okay. Oh, I like this show. Red and purple are great colors to wear at work. <laughs> but this guy isn't working. He's fighting zombies all the time. He's not here to fight zombies. So shitty. The what? You don't like it? The the sound effects are jarring. Well, it's an old game at this point. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't this come out in two thousand and nine or something? That there were great games. I mean, my God, Mario Brothers one was like from nineteen or eight nineteen eighty five or some shit. Like, think about that. You can't run that around didn't a hotel have anything like this. Like this. Yeah, but you can't fucking get annoyed constantly by dumb sound effects either. Like menu sound effects. When you select and start in Mario 1, even in the first menu, it doesn't fucking do that to you. It, it's just... When you kill zombies, it's not like you're fucking investing in the stock market. It doesn't make sense to have the cash register sound. That's the money you're picking up. Why? Where where are you getting this money from? Is that bitch a zombie? It sure Good is. Good morning, Mr. Morgan. Your breakfast is ready for you. Now her back's just she's got scoliosis, man. Leave her alone. She's still gotta do the limbo like everybody else. Shoot her ass. Thank you, Mrs. This is a zombie. Just fine. Yes. Fine. Well then. Thank you, Paul. I'm starving. Is everything all right, Mr. Morgan? Yes. What do you think it's of this music, Polly? My compliments to the chef. I'm hoping my cooking will bring back repeat guests. 
Honestly, though, it's been a while since anyone has stayed here. I couldn't help but notice. Aside from you and me, there seems to be no other guests or workers around. What's that? That's... The salt's in that white shaker there. Thank you. I was wondering if there were any other guests or workers here. Oh, no. No one else. My husband and I used to run this place, but... But then he killed another man with an axe! You're alone since then. Must be hard by yourself. Oh, there also was this little Danny kid that used to roll around on his big wheel. Sorry. It must be difficult to run a hotel by yourself. Well, yes, I suppose. I could just live on my pension. But I have to admit, running a hotel is kind of like a hobby of mine. That's nice. Polly, it might help to hear you better if you could sit a little closer. Oh my, Mr. Morgan, you're embarrassing me. Oh. Early in the day, too. I think I'm a little too old for you. Oh, she, and oh, she thinks he wants to fuck her? Yes. I appreciate the invitation, but I'm fine over here. Polly, I can hardly hear you from all the way over there. You're exaggerating. This is fine. It won't do to be all clumped together. See, this is good storyline. This is good storyline. I don't know how you're not into this. It's got a lady running a hotel that, zombie game. It, that thinks that this guy wants to fuck her because he wants to sit closer to her at the table. It all, like, it's just a great, well thought out storyline. Just a flesh wound. There's a Monty Python reference. I want you to be able to relax here. It's a zombie game, Mel. It's a zombie game. Fight Really? I feel honored. But this is a zombie game. This doesn't make any sense. This is even happening. This woman thinks he's trying to fuck her. He wants to sit closer to her. It is. That's hilarious. This is a zombie game. Say, Polly. What can you tell me about this town? Well, let me see. You might know this already, but the town is called Greenvale. It rains here quite often, but it's a nice place, surrounded with nature. It was a big and prospering lumber town until not so long ago. We used to have a population of <laughs> Like, why is this music going on right now? This hotel was built back then. We saw plenty of guests in those days. Yes, this this was game audio. I don't know what the fuck. This is the weirdest soundtrack to what's going on. Hey, say I mentioned on the Discord we're streaming. Now we got more people in here. That's where I was at. Tell me about the shops. I was in here for like twelve days, and then I had to fly with shops around here. Days as well. Well, there aren't many. It is a small town, after all. You can do most of your shopping at the milk barn. It was now a very store. long trip. Now we're back to the whistling song. I'm sure you'll get to like them. The A and G Diner is a great place. Pipe in to stream is where it is. This is a zombie game. Where to learn to fly? Just want to put that right in front of you right now. No, we're playing a we're playing a grandmother fucker simulator. There's Swery. Did you see Swery? Are for the younger folk. We also have a gas stand. This guy wrote in his own name into the game. Even a gunsmith. You should be able to find what you need. So in case you all know, we found out from the beginning that the, the, the writer and director of the game's name is Sweary, or whatever name. He says his name is Sweary, Sweary, or whatever. Bring your coffee out in a moment. Thank you, Polly. I have to warn you, though. I am very particular about my coffee. The very best you have, please. I understand. And if I really like the coffee, I will put my penis in it. There we go. Oh, this is a serious business. Let's see if this is good enough for this motherfucker here. I'm about to fall asleep. I'm not even joking. That's why I got a fucking Red Bull and goddamn Jaeger. I'm wide awake. I'm getting hit I hard. Think I need with to get a Jaeger. I, I, I'm out of beer. I, I'm I I'm fucking I'm wired right now because of this drink. I need to get a drink. Spring morning. 
I think I only have Red Bull. I don't think I have. The coffee. Fuck! It's coffee. Never fails. Now then, let's get going. Pull the sock out the zipper and douse that ship. You'll be set for life. Your vast deference will be incinerated, but Sam Respice. I don't know what the fuck is going on with. I read out loud what Where Did You Learn to Fly said, and it was really weird, and I didn't understand any of it. Bum nose? Okay. It's supposed to be. You're supposed to read it. You're supposed to read it. You need to read it. I'll be reading it. All right, Jesus fucking Christ. Pull the sack out of the zipper and douse that shit. You'll be set for life. You best deference will be serious. But I know Sam Respus, but I mean, I don't know that he said that. I mean, what is that? I actually don't remember him saying that, but. So if I'm the only guest, the why? The best deference is, is the. Passageway between the sperm and the balls, I believe. Really? Yeah. I didn't know that. But I do because I study biology and shit. But so I'm the only guest. Why does she have all this food out here? I'm dousing it in gasoline. I'm assuming you're you're more than your fast deference will be incinerated at that point. That shit's deep in there. But he probably did say that, but I don't remember. Coffee. Oh, he doused it in coffee. Yeah, that's interesting. Hey, look, there's a secret passage there. See? See that? Oh, yeah. That actually. Yeah, he did say that. Yeah, that makes sense. What do you want? Here we go. Unexpected troubles coming your way. Lucky item lighter. Always trouble hitting my way in this job. But I'm always up for a little excitement, too. Ooh. It's like fucking old ladies? Is that, is that exciting for him? Wow. I really need this Red Bull. All right. I'm taking it now. I'm telling you, the drink I have is like pump me through a cough, caffeine. I'm There's like no fucking theme park in this tons town. of energy now. All that good luck is just slipping away. I'm going for it, man. I think I'll have a thrilling I'm going for the right caffeine. Here, I need it. I think I'm a little bit too far in, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I'm not good. even playing, so that's making me complacent. Although this is just a shitty zombie game, but... But for the people who just came in in the last five minutes, they haven't seen any zombies, so they don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, it makes it even worse for them. They don't even know. All they've seen is this old lady worried that I'm gonna fuck her. That's all they know. Oh, not worried. She wants it. You know it. But she's got scoliosis. I'm probably gonna break her back if I have sex with her, right? Look at her. For sure. For sure. Her break. Her her back is gonna be destroyed by the time I fuck her hard. Like, cause I'm not gonna hold back just because she's old. It's not like she could bend over before though. So like, she's always <laughs> in a perpetual state of being bent over. You're fine. You can go for that. Yeah, she really is. She really is. Where did you learn to fight? She's bowing so hard. Crackers? Twenty dollars for crackers? He's fucking you over, man. They're zombies, dude. Why do you keep bringing up zombies over and over and over, like fifty times? It's insane. How often do you bring up zombies? I hate them. Then why do you keep bringing it up? Because I hate them so much. I can't stop. Why are the door handles protruding so far from the uh, the door? That's pretty fucking rich-ass doors that guy has. 
So I'm staying at a hotel where I'm the only person. 38 fucking zombies destroyed. This guy's not spoke a word of any of it to anyone. Why would you? What are you going to say? I killed 38 undead to get to you. Are you okay? That would be the first words out of my mouth. Oh my god, there's fishing in this game? I don't yes, remember ever doing that. Of course there is. There's just not talking about the That's a turkey that sandwich? Was. It looks like purple, some beets or something. Lord GM says, I think Uno is better than this. I don't know why he's saying that. I agree. Uno is so much better than this. Uno is epic. No, wait. This Something's about to happen. See? Agreed so much. You are fucking Lord Genome. You are the fucking shit. You know what's going on. So we have King George. This game does not deserve a smashed one. update. No zombie well, game deserves a smashed time. update. Let's take it for a spin. This guy, this, I don't know how you're not pulled in with this plot line. This plot line is fucking this amazing. This plot line has nothing to do with the zombies you fight all the time in I the game. Exactly this place. It's horrible. Simply amazing. It makes it even worse. The keys were left on the front hood. And nobody stole the car. Values. This that. town has what the country needs. Values. Let's head over to the sheriff's department. Master key, that's racist. You can't call something a master key anymore. You're not allowed to be a master anymore, even like a master plumber. Damn it. Accidentally got you are really good at driving, man. Shut up. Something here that you want to check out. Your... Shut up. Go through Anna Graham's file at the sheriff's office, but if you want to act on a hunch, then I'm with you. Failure. There we go. I don't know why you played that. Look at me driving. I'm a good driver. Oh shit! It's a dead end. Wow, it turns on a dime. So, Zach, about those bonus features in DVDs nowadays. Hey, the listen to this. From the 80s have almost no bonus material. Even if they do, it's a trailer and the visual quality is pretty bad. Well, that visual quality is a good reminder of those days. So many new audio and visual appliances were coming out back then. Do you remember the first video deck we bought? We bought it to record one of the Star Wars movies on TV. And remember when that video store opened, we spent hours there just trying to find a good movie to rent. There weren't that many to choose from back then. I remember renting some really bad ones after reading those back cover taglines. Hey, remember? Attack of the Killer Tomatoes, filmed in 1978. Produced, directed, written, and edited. See? By Getting a lot of information here. It was really awful, but... For some reason, I still remember it pretty well. It had so many sequels, and the original was re-released in 95. The 87-minute long theatrical release bumped up to a whopping 90 minutes. But that was around the time I joined the Bureau. I never had a chance to see it. I know, Zach. Once He's planning for the three minutes of together, Attack of the Killer Tomatoes that you get to see. Easily. That's his problem in zombie apocalypse right now. Is that. So I'll have to go this way. He's a complicated character, I'll give him that. <laughs> they named the director and everything. Oh, 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 oh. So there's driving in this game. Resident Evil doesn't have this kind of thing, right? Look at this. Driving? Yeah. I don't know, Resident Evil is a zombie game too. Man, like, I just don't care about zombie games. Got some money. For, for nothing. For busted. For oh my god! You should have to pay for your gas. <laughs> Did you see that? The horse? He came out of nowhere! I ran right into that horse! 
Yeah, it didn't even do anything to it. What the? What the hell? I thought I already busted through a bunch of gates. Nope, you are fucked. You now have to back up. You have to get the fasten seat belt sign turned on for your turbulence. Oh my god, how do I get out of this ranch? Jesus fucking Christ. Well, will you at least say, oh, uh, maybe I'll just crash through this. It won't work. Speaking of 80s movies, one jewel in the rough springs to mind. Deadly Spawn. Do you remember that one, Zach? Back in 83, directed by Douglas McCann. Right. It was filmed pretty cheap, but still it was pretty good. The monster design with the mouth crammed full of teeth. I loved it. So many delicious B movie cliches. Did you know See, this is a game B movie. Are you getting it? This is a B movie game. For some reason. They said the zombie game is the world was totally different from the original. I wonder how the sequel turned out. Where's the zombies? You know the monster in that one. I don't know, they went away. Wait, Zach. Sounds a lot like the movie Tremors. Tremors! I think that one was back in 89, directed by Ron Underwood. You you watched so Tremors, right? For Kevin Bacon. Yeah. Masterpiece. Zach, that one had sequels like crazy. I remember there was a fourth one. I've only seen the first one, though. I I used to love Tremors as a, as a kid. Tremors was scary, yeah. That was a good movie. I'm in town. That wasn't a zombie movie, it was about worms and shit. Killer worms, yeah. Better than zombies. Alright, we're gonna do the, at least this one this scene. This game is exactly the, like the pinnacle of why zombie games suck balls. <laughs> Look at my tie! It affected by gravity. <laughs> Where am I now? I'm impressed that the, that the tie was the correct direction. I'm going the wrong way now? I flipped my car. Your tie was actually affected by gravity correctly. Deadly premonition, drunk driving. If you drink and fucking drive, that old lady is gonna slap you right in your penis. Says, where'd you learn to fly? I can turn on my siren. Where did you learn to fly is the authority on how sober you should be to drive. So I trust whatever he says. Or she. I'm not really sure what where do you learn to fly is. Da la 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 la. Fine building for such a small town. The exterior. Why does he do that? La la I agree with you there. Your statement, where did you learn to fly, about not drinking and driving, is very serious and true. Because you don't want to kill a bitch. Because that's going to fucking be on your record. <sighs> Look, it's bum number one as a deputy. Oh, he's grabbing his <sighs> butt. Oh. He's trying to act all cute and coy. Uh, uh... Oh, 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 oh. What was that run? Pleasure to meet you, Agent Morgan. That is not me, expecting. man. I'm Thomas That's McQueen, you. The that, that looks Pacific. exactly like you. I, I would punch that guy in the balls. And then that guy is him. looks exactly like FBI you. FBI Special Agent Francis Thin George face. Morgan. Please like call me a, a jaw that comes calls me. Very hangs well, down man. a little Agent, bit. Agent it's you York. right there. You and you grab your butt all the time. From my car. Thanks. You're always I'm grabbing your butt. I've seen you do it. Just doing my job. I just, I want to help do everything I can to help the investigation. So do you, are you starting to get the appeal of this game yet? Look at, he's falling asleep. Was murdered. Oh no, he's back. She was such I'm a falling bright, asleep. And that's the girl. one. It's me. Yeah, that's why he's just well. like you. Well, no, not really. But it's a I'm very small asleep because this shitty zombie game is I'm bad. Sorry. It's just that. You don't think this it's is good? This really big case I've no. ever seen. What about the guy grabbing his butt? I understand. And the old Just lady trying to have sex with me. Can I have That's a look at Anna's right. file now? Yes, of That's course. The zombie game. The sheriff told me to let you through. To no one room, seen. Most of the people in this stream have never seen the, the zombies the you're talking about. Are. 
Why don't you take a look around while I go look for it? Okay. Let me know okay. things around. Let it go. Look at look at how he moves. Zach, Thomas appears to be the kind and sensitive type. Totally at odds with the monarch. That's how he runs. Almost a good setting for a cartoon. Like Tom and Jerry, which was referenced earlier. Shave? I'm shaving. Hey, what? yeah, you're not going to have a beard now. Why am I shaving? I, I could ask you the same question. Did I get money for shaving? You did get money for shaving. I wish I got money for shaving. That'd be sick. I get money every goddamn day. Why does that can look fucking huge? The Zach, Red Bull? Because it is. It's a big one. Now. Arnold. It's a I big ass Red Bull. That name yet. It Are is. the owner of this dumbbell? What do you think, Zach? Fucking Red Bull. I got a dumbbell. The big ass fucking one. Did you get the gas station? He wants to know. No, I didn't get from the gas station. I got it from a grocery store. We've got one left. Okay. Look, someone wrote this for these two people talking. This person probably has nothing to do with the investigation. Now we know. Ooh, let's talk to Thomas again. I want to kill people. Okay, we'll do that. We'll, after this conversation, we'll do it. Okay. You found the key. Yeah, there we go. Is this the one you were looking for? I'm acting like my daughter. I'm sorry. I just went, ugh. That's what she does when she's totally sick of something. Uh, no, <laughs> this is a gray squirrel. Sorry, that's not the key. Nothing particularly special about the gray squirrel, I'm afraid. You can find them in the U.S., Canada, and in England, too. A gray squirrel. What was I thinking? But we're looking for a southern flying squirrel right now. Ooh! A swallow. African or European? I don't know. So I shall save. Oh wait, no, how do I save? I do not know. Damn it, I, gotta, I, I haven't saved for a while. No, you haven't. You have to go to a phone. Yeah, let's. We gotta. We gotta let's save. Find a phone. Find a phone. The front desk. A phone. There's one. Yeah. There's no cord on the phone for some reason. Did I save? You get money for saving. Yeah. You get money for nothing and your chicks for free. Well, that ain't working. That's the way you do it. Get your money for nothing and your chicks for free. You know that song? I've never heard that one. That's pretty good. You've never heard that song? I mean, it's an 80s song, but it's a very famous 80s song from Dire Straits. Didn't hear it. Never actually encountered that one. Interesting. You can actually do that. That is not a... Uh... Why? The song is real. You can yeah. actually get money for nothing and chicks for free. You get both of those things. Well, he's a rock and roll star, so yeah. He's getting his money for nothing and his chicks for free. No, he's playing music for money, but you can get money for nothing in the stock market. And chicks for free get by just being hot. So both those things are true. It, it really does happen to some people. Like that guy, probably, because he was singing about it. So he probably experienced it more than likely. He could have dreamed about it, too. Some people well, do it that I way. They write just... songs about shit that's not real. Like, that's cool. I respect that, if that's the case. 
Well, you need to start your PlayStation and your stream so I can actually uh, throw to you. Oh, hell yes. Oh, thank you. All right, just keep going there. Yeah. I'll get it ready. Yeah, well, I'm going to go to the bathroom, and I'll be back. Oh, have fun for the viewers. All right. I could have been starting all this up while you were doing all that boring shit a second ago. God damn it. Oh. Controller here. Got the PlayStation, bitches. That's already going. This transition's gonna be quick. That's the good news. I am back. It's Domino. Domino Mano. Welcome to my stream of this Yo. game that is probably one of Bum Number One's favorite games of all time. Tell them why it's your favorite game of all time. It's a zombie game. <laughs> That's what it is. But why is it your favorite zombie game of all time? What uh, up? What is my favorite zombie game of all time? That's a good question because I hate them all. But there's got to be one that stands out among them. What about the Plants vs. Zombies? That honestly could be a very top contender. <laughs> you're, not even, you're not even wrong about that. You're not wrong at all. That one would be very close to top if not top. I really don't like zombie games. So... <coughs> Ooh, a toilet. Can I use this? Send me your uh, video, please. And go ahead and remove mine from your stream, too, so that people can see. What's up, Domino Mono? I'm fucking getting ready to switch over games, thank God. This game sucked. You came in at just the right time of this game it was a not great... being played anymore. I think he was this playing game... Breath of the... He was playing fucking Tears of the Kingdom. It was so good. It was so much fun. And then he switched to this piece of shit and kept it on for like an hour. It was extreme. I could have watched him play fucking Tears of the Kingdom for the rest of the night. It would have been easy. I'm sleeping for nine hours in the jail cell. Agent Morgan, it's time to close the office. Can you view the files tomorrow? <laughs> I see. So that's how things Oh, work I see. Here. Kicking me out of sleeping in the jail the cell, I see. That can wait until tomorrow. This town has its own way of doing things, and you need to respect that. Regular business hours, even during a homicide investigation. Insane. Insane. Not impressive. <laughs> Zach, let's call it a day. We all have to abide by the rules. That's what they're there for. You got my camera feed now. Yeah, I've got it. You I got it. Well, then, Zach, looks like we've got some time to kill. What I need. So I slept in the jail cell until the sheriff kicked me out. That's what happened just now. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Yep. Well, I think it's fun. Because I think that was a sarcastic yep. That was the most sarcastic yep I've ever seen in my life. Or heard in my life. It was pretty sarcastic. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to steal this guy's car. Can I take their car? Damn it, I can't. Sir, let me get in the back of their truck. Sir, let me get in the back of your truck. Man, I'm fast. Look how fast I am.
Look at this guy walk with his hands behind his back. I I was trying to jump on the car, but I wasn't able to. Huh? 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 Man. I'm gonna talk to their gay sheriff. Look at his walk. Actually, he's walking somewhat normal. Let's talk to him. Hello? Did you want something? Okay. Can I take your car? Is this your car? Can I take a ride? Can I get in? Can I get in? I'd like to drive with you, please. Whoa. Oh my god, look at his driving! Holy shit, how did he do that? He drove right through that hedge. And he hit a tree! <laughs> what what kind of driving is that? Did you see what happened, Emily? He drove right through that trench and hit, hit a tree. Moog Trails is here. Oh, it's fucking getting started. It is getting started. It's We're getting about started. To fucking switch on over too. This guy is driving into a tree still. By the by the way, you guys are seeing a broken fucking game. Like they're seeing this guy. They're supposed to have a guy driving home. He drove through a hedge, and now he's just ramming into a tree over and over. This guy works at the sheriff's office. This game is awesome. This is the most awesome, broken, weirdo, doesn't make any sense game ever made. I mean, look at this. It, look at look how broken this is. And we updated it before we played. And look how it plays. Look at this guy. It's a zombie game, man. And he saw his... We, di we did flip the car and see my tie. That was an awesome detail. I will give it that. I have to give the game due credit where it's due, which is... In first person driving in the car, we flipped upside down and my, my tie was hanging in front of my face. That's a lot of detail. That's I don't think I've ever played a game where I flip my car and see my tie dangling down in my face. Can you can you think of a time in the game we've ever experienced that, bum? Are you ready, by the way? Bum I thought I was, but there's a problem. There's a problem. Oh, do I need There's something to... wrong with my NVENC code. NVDDDENC? Well, I'm gonna hit this. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna fuck up this guy. Look at him. Alright, here we go. We have a redemption. Whew, here we go, because Bum's not ready, so you're going to get this. I'm sorry I can't turn on my camera, but here we go. Hey, you interrupted my cheek flicking. Trash it all. I didn't interrupt shit. No, it's fucking where'd you learn to fly with this toe suck video. It's where'd you learn to fly is redeeming his fucking toe suck video again. Oh, that motherfucker. Show me sorry. Please don't want to hear it. It's your fault for putting it in there. That green creep wants toe suck action. Don't forget the little space. He is finishing in his car. We're gonna try. Try one more time without having to restart the computer. I really hope I don't have to restart this piece of shit, but it looks like I might have to. The only thing is that it won't stream. Everything else looks great. It's so shitty. This is a I can't stream problem with an NVIDIA codec. That sounds like a you problem. 
It is a me problem, clearly. So what are they supposed to do? Watch me shoot people? What are they what is this audience supposed to do? They can't even see me. All they see is a game and us talking and me shooting people. I made it. I made it out. Alright, I just had to restart the OBS. So at this point I should be able to get you back where you need to be. Yeah. We're good. We're fucking good, dude. You got this. I'm I'm up in line. Ready to go. Are you live? Yep. I'm ramming this guy though. Do what you need to do and then raid me. I gotta ram this guy away from the tree. I can't move him. I have no impact. Do what you need to do. Back into him and he can come already, okay. I'll try backing into him, but I don't think it's gonna make a difference. I'm stuck. I'm literally stuck. All right, I'm gonna throw my viewers at you. All right, you ready for this? Yep, I'm ready for it. Here we go, I hope you enjoyed Deadly Premonition on the Bite Bitch Network, but now we're going over to Bums Network. We're going over there. Going over there to win. Oh, Captain, oh, Captain, we're going. We're gonna kill now. Things are gonna be different. I actually can do something. Are you ready? Are you ready? Uh, I don't know. I did drink that Red Bull. Are I you ready for a raid? A Are you ready yeah, for I'm the raid? I'm ready for this. So here we go. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. That's all I'm saying. Damn, that's a good raid. I threw those motherfuckers into your channel. Thank you for that. All right, let's fucking uh, get this bitch. Going, get into my. All right, I gotta turn off the switch. PlayStation and all that. Like I'm ready to roll. Yo, Moog, the fuck is up? Thank you for coming on in this bitch. Time 